This is our eighth fight of the night. We've got David McCallum from Hybrid Academy uh, making the walk to the corner. 57 kilos this fight will be contested at. This is also a B-class fight, so there will be no ground and pound, so no headshots on the floor. And I can see uh, from my uh, perspective that uh, David's ready to go. He's jumping up and down um, while our referee's making the final checks. And uh, yes, I think I've uh, seen this kid before, fight, fight before, or it might have been uh, someone else who looks like him. But uh, regardless, he looks like uh, someone uh, who will uh, put on a show for us tonight. So this is a David McCallum from Hybrid Academy. Uh, who will be fighting from the red corner. And fighting out of the blue corner, from England, Zach Mirres. So into the blue corner, we have Zach Marest from England. He fights out of CDMMA. CDMMA. Zach uh, looks very calm, like he's done this uh, a few times before, and that's uh, what we like to see with the fighters. Very confident, very calm, and uh, just need to have a clear mindset when he's stepping into the cage. That's uh, Zach Merritt from uh, CD MMA taking uh, the blue corner, fighting at 57 kilos. David McCallum there, screaming, ready to go, like Braveheart. Indeed. <laughs> Just needs some blue paint on his face. He does have blue shorts, so that counts. That does count, definitely. Here we go. Straight into the action. Kick into a takedown. Yeah, David McCallum straight into that takedown, that double leg. And we've got Zach on his back. Let's see what he can do in his guard. This is a B-class fight, so there's no headshots, no ground and pound to the head. Some nice body shots by David with that left hand of his. Is that working nicely off his back? Trying to work a nice high guard. Zach does have Chris Fensum in his corner. Chris Fensum again is our light heavyweight champ here at Battle Arena. So he should have some good BJJ. I know Chris is a a very good BJJ practitioner. And we can definitely see that with Zach, he's uh, very active, uh, but he's just had uh, David pass his guard and into full mount. Yeah, very active, but very loose with that guard. And now David's dropped down for the armbar, but he went the wrong way. He should have gone the opposite way. It looks nice and tight. The arm looks very bent from where we are. And that's it, he's got it. That's it. It's all over. Nice tight armbar. I honestly thought he'd gone the wrong way. I thought the cage was going to hinder him there. But he, uh, he managed to adjust his hips, switch out to the side, get that armbar nice and tight. Indeed. Uh, you could see the grimace in uh, Zach's face. That was a very tight armbar that David uh, got uh, on his opponent. Very impressive finish. For the announcement. And to win by way of armbar, 
So David's still looking really pumped inside there. I think he's ready for another fight. Indeed, uh, I might jump into the cage and challenge him because uh, the kid looks like he's ready to go another five, six. There's no way you're fighting at 57 kilos. Don't be lying. <laughs> I could try and make the weight, uh, but yeah. Um. Yeah, too many Krispy Kreme donuts on this table in front of you. <laughs> Donuts are not the way forward if you're trying to flatter to 57 kilos. That's what we've learned from this. Uh, okay. 